You've heard of the spelling bee, but how about the brain bee? 18 high school students from around Manitoba are getting together to prove who is the brain when it comes to the brain. It actually started in, in Maryland, at the University of Maryland in 1999 with the International Brain Bee, and that now has spread to over 20 countries around the world. The national competition has been held since 2008 at McMaster University in Hamilton. So it was high time that Winnipeg came on board and we were very happy to do that last year. The format of the competition is simple. Students answer a variety of questions related to the brain. While the questions start off easy, much brain power is required by the time the final six students remain. And by day's end, a winner is crowned. Tia Headworth from River East Collegiate. My hands were shaking. I was like, I could feel my heart pumping. I was like really, really like high pressure just waiting for the next question to come up. After being crowned Manitoba champ, her next stop will be the Canadian Brain Bee in May. Something Rachel Gator knows all about. She won the 2015 Manitoba Brain Bee and is also a student at River East. So what's in the water at the school? They credit an outstanding teacher. I think Miss Secord at our school, she she runs a really great biology program and she's definitely really motivating her students uh, to get involved in things like these. Students also get a chance to tour the labs at the Health Sciences Centre and even handle a brain or two. Gross to some, but educational for these high schoolers. The university hopes many of them pursue a career in the field after today. Neuroscience is certainly a growing field, a lot of things, a lot of interest and it's becoming a very important topic in terms of health. So we're going to need more and more research into these areas to try to find treatments for these diseases. And we need, those people are going to come from the ranks of the students that we had here today. So we hope to see a lot of them working in our labs in the future. But for now, the Canadian competition is on the brain for Tia. It's going to be really interesting. I'm kind of really intimidated by that because it's kind of like the best of the best is heading over there from Canada, so it's really nerve-wracking, but it's really exciting as well. For SHOT TV's GO, I'm Kevin Hirschfield.